Hi, if you've uh, just joining me for the first time, my name is Jason from septictank.co.uk and uh, I'm actually on a live site inspection today and um, I'm going to do a survey, doing a survey for someone who's actually got a septic tank and soak away um, that discharges into a water course. So just to put a bit of context to this, on the 1st of January 2020, um, the UK government is making it illegal for septic tanks to discharge into a water course. And it's also going to be illegal if your septic tank and soak away is too close to a water course. So, um, so I just want to, I think it's down here. I just want to give you, uh, to show you basically exactly who these new rules and regulations are going to affect. And uh, you can see a literal live example of someone who's going to have to um, either replace or relocate their septic tank in order to make it legal and compliant. But I want to show you another way, a surpassing way of how to make your septic tank and soak away fully legal without having to spend 15, 20, 25, 30,000 quid to do so. Uh, it's just up here. So oh, what an amazing day today. It's really, it's warm and uh, yeah, I think it's up here. So let's go through all these nettles here. So here we go, let's rock and roll. Okay, so, aha, I found the water course. So here we go. So I think, so this septic tank is, that's the garden of the house behind me. So most septic tanks are in the back garden. I mean, many septic tanks that were installed in the 40s, the 50s, the 60s, 70s, and even the 80s, <laughs> they just used to literally put a pipe straight from the septic tank into, um, a water course by water course i mean a stream a river a brook culvert ditch etc so as i said from the first of jan 2020 all that will become illegal here we go can you see the, the water course there look at that beautiful but um let me just have a look here aha i got it all right so here we go so i don't know if you can see that but there you go that is someone soak away, literally discharging directly into a water course. So this is what will become illegal from the 1st of January 2020, because basically, oh, just kneel down here. In a nutshell, the government are basically trying to stop pollution because, I mean, further down from here, you've got other houses with gardens back on to this waterway here. And, you know, you've got kids, you've got dogs, you've got animals. So pollution, you know, the germ raw sewage basically goes into a septic tank and raw sewage comes out of a septic tank. And so, um, you know, so obviously, you know, it's a no brainer if uh, someone's been, you know, discharging a load of sewage upstream and it's coming down your way, it isn't going to be healthy. So this is the reason why the UK government are basically making it illegal from the 1st of January 2020 to discharge into a water course. So if this is you, if your septic tank discharges into a water course or is close or the soak away is closer than say 15 meters, which is about 50, 45, 50 foot to a water course, what can you do? Well, typically you've got three options, right? You've got three options. Number one, you can just ignore it and hope that it just goes away. But the reality is, right, the government are taking this really seriously. And um, from the 1st of Jan, uh, we don't know exactly how many officers, enforcement officers they're going to actually put out. But enforcement officers will patrol um, many of the rivers up and down the country and test them to see how much raw, you know, raw sewage is going into them. So if 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 this was me for example they'd come to my house they say look you know your septic tank is a pollution risk sort it out 
if you don't sort them out, then we're going to fine you, we're going to prosecute you. So option number one, I could just ignore that and hope that uh, I don't get any enforcement officers come round to my house. Option number two, option number two is that many people are stressed, they're worried, they're anxious about all this. And so basically they're relocating, they're spending 15, 20, 25,000 quid in, in relocating or replacing the septic tank and soak away. And, um, you know, which is fair enough. I mean, yep, that is sure an okay way. It's a good way to make your septic tank legal and compliant, but there's a better way, you know. So the reason I make these broadcasts is because I want to show you a cost-effective solution without you having to spend 15, 20, 25,000 quid on doing so. All you need is a septic tank converter a septic tank converter and literally what happens is this the septic tank converter literally bolts on to your septic tank you've got your septic tank then you've got your soak away pipe that comes out into the water here well the septic tank converter fits in between the pipe and the septic tank and it turns it converts raw sewage into safe clean organic water and the septic tank converters are endorsed they're approved by the UK government and Instead of having to pay 15, 20, 25,000 quid out to replace your septic tank and soak away, they cost something like 2999, something like that. So, yes, they're like flipping egg. They're, they're, at worst case scenario, you're going to save like eight grand. Best case scenario, you're going to save 22,000 quid. So, please, before you spend another penny, please have a research uh, about septic tank converters. Type in septic tank converter on the internet or you can go to my website which is septictank.co.uk that's septictank.co.uk and you'll see a lot of free advice and free information on my website about septic tank converters and how to beat the septic tank ban without having to fork out flaming you know 10, 20, 30,000 quid to um, to you know, find a solution to your septic tank problem. So please don't let all the all the uh, misinformation on the internet stress you out, worry you. Just you know, do a bit of research on the internet, and as I said, have have a look and do a bit of research on these septic tank converters. They're 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 small little systems. You literally your builder can put them in, you can install them. They're really easy to do. You just literally got to dig a hole next to your septic tank, right? Put in the converter flipping slot in the uh, pipe backfill with soil and uh, and job done so instead of pollution and raw sewage coming out of there you've got flipping clean organic water that's approved by the uk government so i hope this live broadcast today has helped you in in, in seeing a real example a real life example of a, a septic tank uh, that will become illegal, but I'm going to put a septic tank converter in for these people. They were quoted, I think these people here have been quoted something like flaming, <laughs> something stupid like 16, 17,000 quid to fix, to relocate their septic tank and do all this and do all that. They don't have to do that now. It's going to cost them flipping, I think, a flipping three grand instead of flipping 18 grand so you know they're really happy that they're going to save 15 grand and it's something that the builder can do just because i come just because i come on these um you know I, I love helping people i've been doing this for 20 years right doing these site inspections and i haven't got an agenda to scare them or to put a system in for them i just want to come and tell them their options so if uh if you know a, lo a local builder or groundsman, they could easily put a septic tank converter in for you. So there you go. So um, I'm going to have a little more of a look at this septic, this soak away here that's, that's uh, in the water. That was probably pipe was replaced. I mean, looking at that, it looks quite new, but you can't tell with these uh, blue plastic pipes. It could be five or six years old, but someone's obviously just replaced the old clay pipe with them. Um, with a plastic pipe but listen if you want more information or, or to see more free videos about myself all you need to do is go to septictank.co.uk that's septictank.co.uk and you'll find tons of free information and free advice about how to fix your septic tank problems